Hello friends, welcome to Finance MCQ. Friends, today we will discuss the vacancy released by REC Limited. So let's start the video. Friends, REC Limited is a Maharatna public sector enterprise. So they have released the couple of vacancies in various domain. So for this video, we will put our focus only vacancy related to finance domain. Here for finance and accounts discipline, serial number 7, there is a vacancy for manager finance and accounts. It's E5 grade vacancy. The pay scale will be in the range of 80,000 to 220,000. There is only one vacancy. Upper age limit is 40. Here the qualification asked for all finance vacancies are either a CA or CMA but here for manager post you need to have 12 years of post qualification experience and you should have a CTC of least 18 lakh per annum then only eligible. Here your experience asked is it should be in either in financial institutions, scheduled commercial banks, public sector organization, central government, state government or multilateral organization or other institutes then only are eligible. Then next vacancy is for deputy manager finance and accounts. It's E4 grade vacancy. Pay scale is 70,000 to 2 lakh. Here there are total 10 vacancy and for unreserved there are 6 vacancy. Rest are all for reserve category candidates. Here upper age limit is 39 years. Again the qualification is same that is CA or CMA. Here you need to have 9 years of post qualification experience and your CTC should be 15 lakh per annum. Then there is a third vacancy vacancy for assistant manager finance and accounts it's a e3 grade vacancy and here the total pay scale will be in the range of 60000 to 180000 here there are total 20 vacancies out of which nine vacancies are for unreserved category candidate upper age limit is 35 years and you need to have 5 years of post qualification experience and your ctc should be at least of 12 lakh then only eligible and experience should be in financial institution or banks or PSUs, state government, central government organizations. Then there is a vacancy for officer finance and accounts, E2 grade vacancy. Pay scale is 50,000 to 160,000. There are only two vacancy and there are two for ST category candidate. Upper age limit is 33 years. Qualification is same, CA or CMA. Here you need to have three years of post qualification experience with minimum CTC of 10 lakh then only eligible to apply. Concession package. Friends, they have mentioned that apart from your basic pay, you will be paid all other benefits of the company such as DA, lease accommodation, HRA, perks and allowances as per the company's policy. Now, eligibility criteria. Here they have mentioned that for work experience for the post indicated at serial number 1 to 23, in that your finance vacancies are also came, that candidate applying from government organization, PSE, public sector banks, etc. Pay scales must have minimum one year experience in immediately lower pay scale. That is, should be working in one pay scale below at the time of post applied for and this is not applicable to candidate working in government organization PSU equivalent in pay scale or above than the post applied for. So if you are working in a pay scale above than the mentioned in this notification then you are eligible and this condition will not apply to you. And they have specifically mentioned that teaching experience, period of sabbatical, extraordinary leave will not be counted towards work experience for the purpose of eligibility and you should not include such period as in your experience and candidate having experience in more than one organization and if there is a gap between them is 15 days or less then such period will also be counted under experience. So if you have switched job from one to another and there is a gap of 15 days or less then such 15 days will be counted as an experience. Then there is a age relaxation for reserve category candidate you can check them in detail and friends cutoff date for all age and experience is 9th Feb 2024 and regardless to say that if you are working in a government PSU such kind of organization then you need to produce a no objection certificate at the time of interview. Now very important selection process. So friends selection will be based on written test and or, or interview carrying weightage of 85% for written test and 15% for interview respectively and details of written test skill test will be intimated through portal and email. Now how to apply? Friends you have to apply by visiting website of the company under career section. From there you have to apply through online mode only and here you need to pay a application fee of rupees 1000 and candidate belonging to schedule car, schedule tribe, PW BD, ex serviceman, and internal candidate are exempt from making application fee. Then rest details are mentioned. You can check the step by step process for filling application form. Now, important dates, friends, your online application started from today, that is 17th January 2024. Last date of submission of online application is 9th Feb 2024 till 6 pm. And by 5 pm, you have to make your application fee. Then only you will be able to submit your application, and your application will be considered submitted only and only when your payment is received by them. In case you have unable to make payment or payment is not successful, 
then in that case your application will not be considered as a submitted so do make sure your payment gets successful while applying for this vacancy so that's all friend if you are meeting the eligibility criteria then you should give it a try these are the high level positions and if you are looking for further growth in your career then you can give it a try and apply for these vacancies so i wish you all the best thank you so much for watching this video till the end